Hi, this is Tanya. Today I want to share a short piece with you about being thankful and cognizant that every good thing in our lives comes from the Lord who is good all the time. I'm going to read to you from 1 Chronicles 29, verse 10 through 18. It's verbatim through 14. David praised the Lord. This is King David. David praised the Lord in the presence of the whole assembly, saying, Praise be to you, O Lord, God of our father Israel, from everlasting to everlasting. Yours, O Lord, is the greatness and the power and the glory and the majesty and the splendor, for everything in heaven and earth is yours. Yours, O Lord, is the kingdom. You are exalted as head over all. Wealth and honor come from you. You are the ruler of all things. In your hands, it is written, are strength and power to exalt and give strength to all. Now, our God, we give you thanks and we praise your glorious name. But who are we that we should be able to give as generously as this? Everything comes from you, and we give only what comes from your hand. O oh Lord, our God, as for all this abundance that we have provided for building you a temple for your holy name, it comes from your hand, and it all belongs to you. Amen. I know, my God, that you test the heart and are pleased with in our integrity. All these things we give willingly and with honest intent. O oh Lord our God, keep this desire in the hearts of us, your people, forever, and keep our hearts loyal to you. So that was the prayer King David led his people in, dedicating the temple, from what I understand. And if you remember, he's giving God all the glory. He's praising and worshiping the Lord and acknowledging that everything he's giving in worship to the Lord comes from the Lord so here's my point it hit me again today when a friend offered to graciously do something that saved me some money and time and effort especially time and effort so I didn't have to do it to complete something of a God activity that the Lord's leading me to do this weekend hallelujah and that it just struck me again about the grace of God and I told her I said you know every good thing we have comes from him and then he teaches us to give in obedience and he gives us the grace to do it and then he rewards us for obeying him he's so awesome i can only use that word for god awesome <laughs> and so good which is part of his awesomeness so david is acknowledging king david that the lord is lord that everything is his and he's giving thanks and praise to his glorious name. And he's, he's going, who are we that should be able to give as generously as this? What we give comes from you. He's acknowledging that. And then he said, for all this abundance we have provided for building you a temple for your holy name. It comes from your hand and it all belongs to you. So different times as I go through this passage with the Lord, my time with the Lord, it struck me. Actually, a few years ago, it struck me that. We're not just talking about money here. No, we're not just talking about money. The Lord gives us every good thing. Anything we have to give that's good. Words, encouragement, praise, prayer, intercession, worship, and physical things like, or also other intangibles like gifts and talents, service. Those are huge. And tangible things like material possessions, houses, cars, or also opportunities to help people do something or witty business ideas physical things they need money too all of that comes from the Lord and when he leads us to give it to sow it there is a guaranteed harvest and we receive it so he was encouraging me and reminding me that he's taught us to sow praise the Lord and he is a faithful rewarder of us who seek him and obey him and I'm excited about my harvest so you should be too so he's the one that teaches us to do good gives us what we need to do good and rewards us for doing good i just want to brag on our awesome god today and so you can expedite your harvest by thanking him and praising him for it receiving it with your words your faith and continuing to sow as he leads and making a wonderful cycle of continual sowing and reaping so god bless happy sowing happy reaping bye bye